My dearly beloved in Christ, we should give thanks to God today that he has allowed us to see the beginning of another year, that he has given us more time to love and serve him and to work out our salvation. What a tremendous gift is the time that God gives to us, that we might live in a Christian manner in this life and thereby deserve to be with God forever in the next life. So what will we do for this year, for the year 2019? And people typically make resolutions, but above all for us, our resolution should be, I will strive to avoid sin. Sin is the enemy of God, and sin, especially speaking of mortal sin, is the only thing that can separate us from God. Mortal sin is the implacable enemy of God. It is the most execrable thing in the world. It is the source of that flood of evils that inundated the world after the fall of man. It is the greatest of all evils because it can destroy us for eternity. It is the one real evil, more to be feared than any sort of punishment imaginable. St. Augustine says, God is the highest, the greatest good, and mortal sin is the greatest evil. So we must dread it, but we must also resolve today, at the beginning of a new year, during this year, I will not offend God by a mortal sin. I will also strive to avoid venial sin, but above all, I will dread And I will avoid all mortal sin, to stay away from the occasions of sin, that we might please God in our lives. So make that your primary resolution for this new year, that we will strive to avoid sin and that we will always remember that the time God gives us is given to us for the purpose of striving to work out our eternal salvation that we might be with him forever. Let us make that our primary goal in this year. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Ghost. Amen.